It is time for Beckett's from China. Welcome back to the Wicked Gamer and Collector. And if you're seeing this, this means you're just as curious like me. And I really wanted to know what's inside the Pandora's key number 7. Alright, but then there's the question, how can we open it up? We need a screwdriver. And we got here at the bottom, or the top of the case, I don't want to pronounce it. We've got three screws. We're going to pull it out and let's see if it's going to get open. All right, people, it's finally the moment. All right, let's take a close look and what are we going to find in this box and what are the differences? All right, let's take a close look at the buttons and the joystick itself. Um, they wired like they always do with little sleeve over it. Very neatly done, little tie wrap here. Yeah, what I don't get is why they are choosing for a round octogate. You got a 4 and 8 way, but they are just choosing for a round version. I have really no clue why this is. Really nice clickies to it. I'm getting the idea they have different versions of buttons, because the black and the white version are cl more clickish than the green, or the green, the red and the yellow one. Really neat. Nice. All right, and let's take a close look at the speaker that is built in this Pandora box. Uh, it looks like it's exactly the same like they used in the previous models. Uh, what kind of speaker is this? This is, what I'm, if I'm reading it correctly, this is a 5 watt speaker, 60 ohm. And yeah, the quality, I don't know. It's just a basic speaker, nothing special to it. It's very loud, I must say, and yeah. It gives a good reflection of the sound of the soundtracks of the game. I think that is very important. I don't know why they are yeah, still choosing for a mono speaker or one speaker. I personally prefer two speakers, one left and one right. I know it costs a little bit more, but that will give you that maximum experience because the music and the soundtrack is one of the most important things of a video game. Or that is my opinion. And like all previous models, they are using this RGB LED strip that is connected so I can see to the main board. Yes, they wired it into the main board. And um, I think they are cutting off here the power for the LEDs. But yeah, there is no switch, so, and I'm not talking about the Nintendo Switch. I am talking about just the switch. And um, yeah, there's no way of throwing it off. So if you don't like the lighter feature, you need to cut it off or yeah, you're not able to pull it out because there are more things connected here. So if you pull this one out, you're, uh, yeah, you're killing your mainboard because it will not have any power. Alright, for the final part of this video we are going to check out what is the beating heart of this mean machine. Yeah, um, they are using a totally new revision of mainboard if I'm checking this one out and comparing it with the old version. First of all, they added a cooling element with a little fan. I'm really pleased about it because that was something I was a little bit concerned about because the old version doesn't have any cooling element at all, not even a passive one. Yeah, it's running on an octa-core, they have told me, and this one is having 1080p signal output, and the previous one had only 480i or p, or uh, compared with the Pandora box 5, it only got 720p. Good enough, but this one had higher resolution. So finally, it's full HD. Woohoo! Got a little button here, power button, USB connector for connecting to your PC. Hmm, interesting. And here we have a CF slot. And like the Android box, it got it at the back, so you can stick it in from the outside. But they have told me there is a way of adding more stuff to it. So that is really interesting about this main board and this Pandora box. Um, yeah, there's a little bit of the tour of the Pandora box. If you have any questions, you can also leave it in the comments. And um, don't forget to subscribe to the for the channel. So, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome videos. And see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.